This is Alice. We've dressed her in different clothes and even changed her hair. But whatever she's drinking and recycling, are you wondering what happens once it's left her tiny little Gen Z digits? I know I am. First up, Steve in his multicolour truck dumps it all at the recycling centre. He's like a magpie for those crushed cans. Now we join Eddie, who's picking out his favourite items to make a collage for his mum's birthday. He's her number one son. He likes to separate what isn't aluminium, and he's made this machine which works using actual magic. Then these tiny little shiny pieces shoot down the conveyor belt ahead of a game of one-ton Tetris. About 70,000 cans in each of those cubes. It looks like Simon's having another great game. Might even be pushing for a personal best. Albeit he always leaves someone else to tidy up his mess. Be better, Simon! Now this isn't an aerial shot of the start of the London Marathon, but in fact our shredded canny friends getting ready for their film debut in the latest sci-fi movie, The Furnace. It gets up to 750 degrees centigrade here, which is still cooler than your pillow in a heat wave. Now here comes the Bridge North team, winners of best bubbling aluminium for two years running. Oh, and you can hear why. But, well, I'm not sure what sort of fishing attempt is being tried here. You won't catch anything in there, my friend. Silver River, Silver River, Silver River. Just warming up the voice ahead of the next fixture. Look at that shiny goodness. But here we are, the moment we've been waiting for. Giant ingots. They got past Sporting Lisbon in the last round. And we'll look at this. Tall, strong, and over half a metre thick, it's no wonder they're the favourites in these parts. But, well, they may be big, but they've been well and truly squashed here. I make that ten passes uh, through the machine, and, well, it looks like they're now down to about two millimetres, running very, very fast here indeed. Now, thin and ready. Been a few years since I could have said that about myself, but here we are. They all line up, ready to go. And here comes the packaging! Cans, cans, and more cans. So shiny, aren't they? I think I'd like my bathroom done like that. Over the hill with military precision. They've certainly found an opening here. It's all coming together nicely, working up quite a thirst now. And of course, it's not just cans. This aluminium is so easily recycled, it'll keep coming back again and again. Foil trays now. Anyone for a mince pie? Three million a day. It's a number only the very best could dream of. Sliding over to the right. Is that a call for a pen? And now they're in the box. It's superb teamwork. And from recycling centre to supermarket warehouse, it's a tidy job once again from start to end. Saving 95% of energy and carbon emissions when compared to making the same thing from new. It smiles on faces all round.